house. It's cold. Woo! I'm trying to decide if I should clean my kitchen or do yoga first. I think we're gonna clean because I'm here. I feel kind of gross. Oh, look, look at that, lovely. Let's clean. <laughs> Merry Christmas, baby Rain is coming out to play Santa Claus is packing the presents Making sure you've been behaving okay Merry Christmas, honey yeah. The snowman's dusting off his hat on the show for everybody to give them a smile that lasts another year. There's something that happens when sleigh bells are ringing when December ends, when the children are singing. Yeah. It's Merry Christmas, baby. Merry Christmas, baby The snow is laying two feet deep Now wish upon a falling star Oh, we got the snowblower out See you next summer, spring <laughs> I love this No one else staying in here, come on guys Come back in In the house when the children are singing, yeah. It's Merry Christmas, baby. Ooh, yeah. They thrown at the table for big and for small. All the fire is popping, the chest not so cracking, yeah. Merry Christmas, baby. for the day for the record like I take the kids to school in my pajamas we do all those things if you're new here you don't know that if you're not new here you know that <laughs> I also realized I'm just like blah 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 and I didn't show you guys my new floors so they finally were done um, it ended up taking like four or five days longer than I thought it was even gonna take but not the end of the world they look beautiful I'm gonna flip you guys around and just show you if you remember what they were before if i can find a clip i'll insert it here uh show you the oak they were oak hardwood floors and i'll show you what it looked like while we were waiting for them to be installed it was like two months of just having underlay well not even just having like press boards everywhere so i'm gonna flip you around and show you what we got we got a durable hang on so what we got, we ended up getting all new baseboards too, which is really nice. Uh, yeah, we ended up getting a very durable higher end laminate. 
I love it. I freaking, hi, we can't do it. I'm not talking to you, Bubba. I'm not talking to you. I absolutely, Charlie, <laughs> go away. Like, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. It's hard to tell today because it's not like super bright or anything outside, but I'm in love. If you remember what it looked like, it just matches this room so well too. Oh, the lights are on. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm in love with it. But the only thing I'm not in love with there's a lot of stuff on my counter because we live here. <laughs> There's always fruit and if I don't leave it out, I'm gonna put these away from breakfast or from making lunch today. If I don't leave the stuff out, then it doesn't get eaten. So actually these can be put away. These are exclusively for lunch. Doo -doo -doo. <laughs> Real day in the life, you guys. Got some CBN, CBDN. It's like a different version of CBD. It's pretty good and you use it for sleep. Wow, I have a lot of bread. I didn't think I had this much bread, okay. Can you say ADHD? What was I doing? Not that. <laughs> uh, this is what I'm not a huge fan of, the transition. Also, I need to sweep my floors, so don't judge that. Because we have really dark in here, and it's like beige walls, kind of brown almost. So we have goals, long-term goals, where we want to make everything brighter, whiter, uh, carry that same flooring into here. But it's not like horrible, right? It's not horrible, it's just different. So. Eventually, this will be all throughout the main floor, but I'm so excited, guys. I think it looks amazing. I mean, I, you know, I love it. I'm just so grateful and happy. If we had to have a leak and this is what had to happen, that's great. It feels amazing under my feet. It's not loud or anything that had a really thick, uh, the boards are really thick. They're really good underlay under it. Super, super excited. Couldn't be happier. Do you like my trees? My Aunt Lori bought these and didn't like them for her house, so she bought them for me. I showed them at the beginning of the video. I may or may not have. I'll insert a clip here, but they're so cute. And I said I have the perfect spot for them, which is right here. So now I'm going to go and work out before I lose any steam or motivation to do so. You can come with mom and do yoga. I'll come do yoga with mom. Okay, so I'm not trying to give you guys a good boob shop. It's just happening. I just have to say. So if you've been following me for a while, you know I have Crohn's and weight gain has been a struggle for me for a while. It's not a struggle anymore. This bra. <laughs> it used to fit. Actually, it was a little big. And now I'm actually going to go change because this is indecent. But I just think it's funny. And part of me is like a little bit proud. Like part of me is like, what? Okay, I gotta stop. <laughs> but I've said this before in my videos and we're gonna chat on my side table. Um, Jamie said, like, you have a power with your words and you have manifested every body shape you've ever had. And he's totally right. He's like, you know, I was like, I wanted to be thin. Careful what you wish for, <laughs> how I got there. But then I said, you know, I just want a few curves. I just want a little bit. I want a little bit of my boobs back. I want a little bit of my butt back. And like, ask and you shall receive. <laughs> Full stop. Can't believe I live in your thoughts. I think about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful delight. Everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found You're the rose in a garden And it shows if I'm honest
Also, I have not unpacked. I went to my mom's this weekend. I'll get to it. All right, I might as well do it now. Also, the fun part about going home is does your mom always send you home with stuff? She saw these on sale and got one for me and one for my sister. So we're just gonna put this downstairs. A um, bunch of uh, bath soap thingies. Oh my God, oh my God, can we try again? Body wash. Thank you. And a shacket that she, I was actually with her when she bought this last time she came to visit, but she decided that she doesn't really love it. But I mean, I love it. Let me just show you. <laughs> Don't ask me why I'm walking around in a bra. Well, it's not a bra, it's like a sports bra. I'm really hot. That really made me warm. <laughs> okay, let's see. It's from Old Navy. It's kind of heavy. It's like, I don't know, it's like a, fuzzy material but it's got some weight to it it's only a large I think which for me the problem is I have orangutan arms so but I think it'll be nice to throw over things I don't know I think it's cozy and she didn't want to return it so I'm keeping it <laughs> I'm planning to decorate this week this weekend at some point all of my totes are downstairs Jamie's gonna bring some of it up for me but I thought I might start today. I'm honestly just kind of like, pfft. I have a phone appointment or like a video virtual phone call at 11 and just for therapy. I only do that once a month now. And it's, she's mainly just a really good person that I get to vent to. <laughs> but I think I'm going to make a breakfast sandwich right now because I'm very hungry. Like starving hungry. So just egg, cheese and an English muffin. something weird with my stove it's like not pushing up against anyway it's not squaring up like it should ever since I did the flooring like my fridge isn't fitting back the way that it should and when we bought my fridge it's ginormous oh my god my hair's getting so long it's ginormous and barely fits in that little area to the point where like okay it sticks out beyond my door right here which is fine with me because we need a big fridge. Matter of fact, we could probably use a bigger fridge. But yeah, also on another note, I wanna get a haircut and I have a whole bunch of options. I'll insert them here and maybe you could let me know what you like better because my undercut is growing insanely. You see this? So I kind of want to chop all my hair off to that length. And I used to have a bob. Anyway, <laughs> I can't stay focused today. Okay. That for you, oh, cause you were never there for me. Mm, don't go ask me what you did wrong. Mm, ignorance will never see. No, wasn't it for me? Mm, why don't you just let it be? All right, I'm gonna grab myself some water. I also, um, yeah, I know it doesn't look too appetizing. I decided I didn't want an English muffin. Hang on. I decided I wanted toast instead. And I'm not 100% watching what I'm eating, but I went from feeling like I could eat anything because it didn't matter because I wouldn't gain weight to now I'm like, it's not just about the weight gain either. I'm noticing some things are starting to revert back to before I had my really bad flare up in like February, March. And I don't want to end up there again because I was really, really sick. So I have to kind of start checking what I'm eating, making sure I'm getting all my water in, trying to take care of my health, my physical activity, and just my overall well-being. So just like any of us should do, right? So I'm trying to cut out things like excessive amounts of processed sugar. I mean, when I had my, after my flare up, I cut everything out. I cut all processed everything and I felt amazing. It just didn't feel realistic for me because I really missed a lot of things. So. I get to try and find a happy medium and hopefully that works for me. But right now I'm going to eat this toast. Hi, would you like some? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and eat this and yeah, just veg out for a little bit. I still have some laundry to do. I haven't changed the litter or anything like that and some of my daily chores, but I'm going to zone out for half an hour, eat my breakfast, drink some water and we'll see what's next. Are we going to do some laundry? All right, go do laundry. Come on, go in the 
basement. Let's show them where the basement is. You don't go in the basement, you're a big scary. Okay, <laughs> Proxy. is coming Start sending your letters off to Santa Christmas is coming yeah. Let it be nice if you want your present Licking your lips over there. Cleaned out the cat food. Christmas is coming. Yeah. Spotting some sleigh rides and some jingle. have been staring at me and we're probably pushing the limit right now but they're gonna make really good banana bread so I'm gonna go ahead and get that going if you guys have been around for a while you've seen this cookbook it's got some recipes like from oh my god so you know what cookbooks used when it's got like food all over every page I am making frugal fit mom this is my favorite banana bread recipe so Check it out. Check out Frugal Fit Mom Banana Bread. I'm pretty sure there's a video all over YouTube about it. I'm not, I'm not, I wanna be like one of those aesthetic kitchen people. Also, I put my hair up because it's making me crazy. My flour's in the flour bag. It doesn't go in a pot. My sugar's in the bag it came into. Leave a comment down below if you're unesthetic as I am. Oh shit, I lied. Doesn't get much more aesthetic than this. A little artificial vanilla. Oh, bananas and song. Bananas and song.
This is creamy, in case you're curious. <laughs> I'm too lazy to get a blender out. But I'm sure people were making banana bread long before electricity existed. Well, you know what I mean? Well, maybe not. When was the banana bread invented? Somebody tell me, huh? Let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling is in the oven. I'm gonna flip you around and show you the recipe just in case you do want it. I also took out some chicken breasts for supper. We don't eat a big port or we don't eat big portions of meat so two chicken breasts will feed four of us tonight. That's who's here tonight and I think I'll probably make it with potatoes. I don't know what to make though honestly. I'm in a rut. Is anyone else in a supper rut? Like I'm like you guys just want to get pizza or Chinese? <laughs> It's becoming the thing, but I really want to cook again more, but I'm tired of cooking casseroles and pasta all the time. So I'm trying to come up with new things. So anyway, I've got that chicken out. I think I actually, oh no, I think I have cabbage. I think that's still good. I'll make some cabbage. I love cabbage, like love it, love it, love it, love it. I'll cook that and potatoes. It's probably gonna be a basic meal tonight, but at least we'll eat and it won't be Chinese food. <laughs> okay, here it is. If you want to screenshot it, Here's Charlie if you want to screenshot him. <laughs> and this is it here. I cook it at 325 because I find it tends to burn. And yeah, it usually takes closer to 50 minutes. It just depends on your oven. And now it is almost one o'clock. My hair looks really dirty today. Oh well, it's not. It's just, it's just at that point. Now I'm gonna make myself some lunch. I think I said yesterday I was gonna have hot dogs. Ooh, I might do that. I don't know. Like, I was half thinking I would make some vegetable soup, maybe, and crackers. Maybe, I don't eat beans. I love, I freaking love beans, but with crumbs, it's not. It's not always an enjoyable process. I've got all these soups in the back, but I don't like cream with mushroom. That might be good. I don't really like this. I was really disappointed in the broccoli cheese soup from Campbell's. Anybody else? I don't think I have chicken noodle. Or is this chicken noodle? Is it my last one? Yes! Maybe we'll have that. <laughs> There's something very nostalgic about eating this soup. I freaking love it. And I have like an hour and a half before I need to leave the house and pick people up. So I'm making some chicken noodle soup. And I'll have saltines and butter with them. I'll put all the water. I'm gonna heat up my chicken noodle soup, make some saltines with some margarine on them. And then I'm gonna watch the last episode of The Handmaid's Tale because I it came out last Wednesday, but sometimes when there's season finales, I don't watch them because I get really worked up. <laughs> like Belle and I haven't watched the last two episodes of last season's Yellowstone. And I know that the new one comes out tonight, I think. Is it tonight? Anyway, we still have to watch last season because we weren't ready for it to find out we don't like cliffhangers. So we're probably gonna watch those two, then watch that season finale. I got a lot of shows to watch this week. I'm gonna be busy. I'm gonna eat my soup now. Okay, why is this undone? What the heck? And also I kind of feel like, oh God, what is that? That's banana. Don't panic, it's just banana. I'm kind of liking like oversized plaid shirts. I'm just gonna start walking around in moves. Fuck it. <laughs> Oh. oh, I think I threw banana on her by accident. 
Costco. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, I'm watching way too many, way too much TikTok. This is what happens when you have a mastic. You never know what you're touching. Is that butter, banana, or drool? Go ahead and comment. You're disgusting. Oh my God, when's the last time you washed your hair? I made the mistake of searching up my name on Google and discovering it on some chat groups. <laughs> oh Lord, the stuff they had to say about me. Basically, I'm a stoner who doesn't work, doesn't wash her hair, mentally ill. I mean, that's all true, but it's how you present it. You know, you know? This is a lot of practice. Look. But I like dipping them in my soup. It's really the only reason I want soup. I haven't filmed the mukbang in forever. And a big reason I'm not filming, can't really see it right now, is the stain on my tooth. It's really making me self-conscious and I'm trying to get the fuck over it. It's what it is, folks. You have good days, you got bad days. Look at that. Tower of saltines. Come on. You guys can't see, but I'm dancing with the dogs. I'm not dancing alone, I'm not crazy. Once she's a friend of mine, taking it easy, taking it easy. Don't let the sound of your own wheels make you crazy. <laughs> Lighten up while you still can. Don't even try to understand. I don't know the rest of the words. Oops. I'm gonna fold clothes and watch my show. I'm the only one who does laundry because Jamie does things like, oh, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna throw it in. It's just my clothes. This is why you don't wash fluffy blankets with your clothes, okay? Now I gotta throw them in the laundry again. And now look at my pants just from touching his pants. So now I have to change again. <sighs> it's fine. <sighs> Wardrobe change. All right, let's go check the banana bread. Oh my God, that is, that is a dirty stove, whatever. Put that banana bread. I think I'm gonna leave it in for 10 more minutes, just to be safe. I'd rather a little bit dry. You can just put lots of butter on it. 10 more minutes. I said it usually takes 50. We're at, we're gonna be at an hour and five minutes because I, put a knife in the middle of it and it came out soaking wet. That's all right, I'm still watching this. All right, here it is. I tore off a little edge just to kind of peek at it, but I'm hoping it's cooked in the middle. I don't know, I just kind of want to cut it down and see, but I'm gonna take a slice and show you guys what it looks like. There you go. Mm -hmm. And there's whole pieces of banana. You could blend it up better, but. So it's not like super sweet. And usually it is when I make it, but I almost always put chocolate chips or pecans or something in it. Mmm. It's just right. It's super good. I'm gonna shove this in my face and then I gotta go pick Bella from school. And Jamie texts me I don't have to pick up Sebastian because he's getting picked up by somebody else. So, here we go. Pick it up. 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 Pick it up.
it's literally cold enough for me to wear a winter coat right now. Well, let's get this. I'm wearing a winter coat. <laughs> you know you're from Canada, eh? <laughs> My car says it's five degrees. I'm gonna go get Belle. And then we'll come home and figure out what we're doing. Do you guys have a bowl of candy that you can't stop if you nap? <sighs> like all joking aside though, these are my weakness. These are rockets, but I think in the US you guys call them Smarties. So good, freaking love them. Anyway, I grabbed Belle from school. I didn't record any of that. And I think my plan is to just uh, like pan fry up these chicken breasts with some white rice and some cabbage. And that's all we're gonna do. If he thinks I'm talking to him, he just won't stop staring at my banana bread. So good, it's so good, you guys. Anyway, I'm probably gonna shut the vlog down here. I'm just gonna, if you can't tell I'm exhausted, I find that it takes a lot out of me lately to do this, which is probably why I'm doing them few and far between. But I kind of wanted to start getting my feet a little bit wet so I could start doing a little bit more because I thought I would do like a version of Vlogmas. I don't know. I just always feel really inspired and happy at Christmas. So maybe, maybe not. You wanna say bye, Charlie? You wanna say bye? Yeah, you wanna say bye? You wanna say bye to everybody? You say bye? Bye guys. <laughs> Alright guys, I will see you whenever I decide to vlog next. I hope you have a great week. Bye.